Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises to Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Wa Raka Kodash. All right. Double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that ruled well. And uh, peace and salutation to your Akim that's pushing his word in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the earth. All right. I wanted to do a quick video, you know, going into the herbs or basically uh, this de uh, particular detox that um, I had picked up um, that's, you know, basically that's helped me tremendously. You know, I feel I feel a lot better by um, taking it daily now. And it's called um, Black Seed Bitters Detox, all right, or BSD. I don't know if you can see the image here. Well, here you go. All right, this is the bottle. It's a dark amber bottle with the yellow label, all right. Now, it, it's many uh, versions of this, of this detox, Black Seed Detox or Black Seed Bitters. All right, you just basically you just want to make sure you know that, um, of course you know it's no GMOs, you know it's it's organic ingredients, okay, you know, but um, I, as I can say, you know, I actually use this product in particular, and you know it's legit, you know it's a good product, you know what I'm saying because of all the you know or well, just growing up. You know what I'm saying? We didn't really have the understanding of how to, you know, what to eat and how to eat properly. You know, we damn sure didn't know nothing about, you know, keeping the law on, as far as what, you know, uh, the dietary law as far as what to eat and not, and not to eat in um, Leviticus 11, right? So, you know, a lot of us was just eating any goddamn thing, you know, especially these fast food, you know, restaurants, you know, what, McDonald's, Wendy's, Burger King, Taco Bell, Right, I mean, j even to stretch red lobster, you know, eating crabs and shellfish, pork, you know what I'm saying? All that shit fucks your system up, you know what I'm saying? And, and hey, even though you may not eat those things now, but the things that you ate, you know, whether it be five, ten, fifteen years ago, they still have a, um, they still take a toll on the body, you know, they help break your body down, and we have to cleanse ourselves of these. Um, um, basically these worms, these parasites that's created by these foods, you know, especially that pork, man. That pork is a killer. You know what I'm saying? It's no degree that you can cook. <laughs> so like you can burn pork and it's still going to be parasites in that shit, you know, and as the saying go, you know, you are what you eat. So, you know, if you're eating that pork or if you ate that pork, right, those things take, you know, years to I mean, it's it's it, it lives within you, you know. It becomes a part of you, actually. You know what I'm saying? And I'm 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 beginning to learn that, you know, certain cravings that you may have, are not necessarily of yourself. It's not because you want it. It's it's because the certain worm or the parasite that's within you craves these type of, uh, um, you know, snacks or certain foods. You know, ideally, um, um, cheese. You know, uh, breads, um, sweets, certain sweets. You know what I'm saying? Those commercial sweets, you know, fucking Kit Kats and M&Ms and uh, what else? You know, Almond Joys and Twix and all that type of bullshit. You know, Hostess Cakes and uh, Apple Pies and Ho-Hos and all that shit. You know, y y your body started, like, craving that shit because... That's what keeps these parasites alive, actually. You know what I'm saying? So if you don't do something to to rid them, you know, to, to, to flush them out the body, you know, they're going to continue to persist. You know what I'm saying? And in that, you're basically um, 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 poisoning yourself, okay? But, um, again, you know, this detox right here, all right, this Black Seed Detox, it's a great detox because it's something that you can take daily. You know what I'm saying? You you can take it while you're, you know, going through your regular, you know, regimen of food. Even though, you know, in time, I will believe that, you know, as your body began to detox, you're going to start um, actually craving a different type of, um, you're going to have like a different taste palate. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to desire, you know, certain things that, that you ate. 
You know what I'm saying? I, and, you know, that's what I'm experiencing right now, where, like, I already had, like, a, a you know, I, you know, brothers know, you know, you know, <laughs> in the camp, they know I have a particular um, palate. I like certain foods. I like, you know, good foods. I don't really like, you know, junk. You know what I'm saying? But basically, that's just amplified. You know what I'm saying? Where, you know, I might previously I might you know have some fried chicken you know what I'm saying you know brothers just sometimes you have a taste for fried chicken you know or, or fried fish or this and that but as of late with me taking this detox like I really even more so detest that shit you know and it's lawful you know fish is lawful you know what I'm saying you know chicken is lawful but I think it's the fried the thought of it being fried you know what I'm saying with all you know that that what that flour you know what I'm saying? And those uh, uh, so certain natural flavors, flavorings and seasoning, you know, and, and, hell, just to be in fried and oil, you know what I'm saying? That shit is, is, is um, damaging to your body. And it's like, I don't even, like, I don't even, like, want that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes you may not have, you know, it's been times where I haven't, may not have the time to, you know, get a meal together for the house or, ha you know, have a woman, you know, cook up something. So, you know, you might have to make a mad dash and buy something out and about. And normally I know I would go, you know, grab some chicken, you know what I'm saying, just because it's quick, easy, and cheap. You know what I'm saying? You go get you a 50-piece somewhere or whatever, you know, wing dings or something, and maybe put some size with it. You might put, but or speaking for myself, you know, I would put some cabbage, you know what I'm saying? I would put, you know, maybe some, uh, you know, roasted potatoes, mashed potatoes, you know, some uh, Brussels sprouts or something with it just to kind of, uh, you know, balance the meal out. But now, you know, when it comes, it's, man, especially just this week, you know what I'm saying? Be like, man, fuck that. I don't even want that chicken. I don't even want that fried food, basically. You know? You just don't, you, you just not going to desire certain things, you know, whether it might be, you know, pies or cakes, ice cream, you know what I'm saying? These things are good, you know, in moderation. They may not be good for you, you know, but you might have a hankering sometimes to just, you know, to, to, to dive off in a certain, um, you know, you might get that sweet tooth or whatever, but lately I haven't even been desiring none of that shit, you know. I would, would much rather, you know, eat some fruit, you know what I'm saying, some vegetables, a nice salad, you know what I'm saying, a green salad or a smoothie or, or a fruit salad, whether it be like, uh, lately I've been eating like mangoes and blueberries, um, uh, uh, you know, oranges, apples, grapes, strawberries, uh, blueberries, if I didn't already mention that, uh, bananas, you know, like that's my that's my sweets lately. You know what I'm saying? I know it, and it and it's been heightened, so I know it's attributed to this detox. You know what I mean? But I um, just want to read a little information on this. And mind you, by the way, you know what I'm saying. And also, I should say, you know, because uh, I know the brother down in Mississippi, he put a video up. You know, um, dealing with you know cleansing the body of parasites and this and that. And you know I've done certain cleanses like that, but um, for speaking for myself, it's just like especially in the capsule form. You know sometimes it be it can be overbearing because it be a lot of capsules you got to take, and you be like, damn, I can't get all these capsules down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? A lot of times you know, or the easy way to go about that is just you know crack them open, you know put them in a drink or something. You know, because just all the swallowing, all these different caps, you'd be like, just my, my throat can't can't handle it. I don't really like swallowing things myself, you know. I like to chew my food and digest it. I don't like just popping shit. But um, but nonetheless, it's, you know, what the brother put up was a, it's a great, a great cleanse, though, by the way. You know, if you can, if you have the spirit to, um, to, to bear it. But, um. But again, with this, you know, with this Black Sea Detox, you know, it's in a liquid form. So, you know, it goes down quickly and it simulates, you know, very fast because because of it being liquid. 
Now, the only downfall of that is that it is bitter. <laughs> like, it's bitter as fuck. You know, it says it in the name, Black Sea Detox Bitters. And, I mean, it's extremely bitter. So, you know, if you already get this, you know, just bear yourself and prepare yourself. Just get it down. Just get it in you is the point. But you, what you want to do is take um, two tablespoons um, in the morning before eating, you know, your first meal, preferably like 30 minutes before eating your uh, first meal. And then you want to get it sometime in the evening, you know, 30 minutes before you have, uh, say, the last meal of the day or whatever, you know. And you're going you to feel it begin to work upon you. You know, you feel a little more energetic, you know, it's like it's as if, you know, somebody like cut the lights on or brighten the lights, if you will. But, um, um, you know, uh, aches and pains should begin to leave the body. You know what I'm saying? You're a little more um, um, flexible and limber. You know, you got a little more of a pep in your step. But most of all, you, f you feel your, um, you know, your colon. And your whole digestive tract, you know, being cleansed, even to the point, you know, you may you may drop a few pounds, you know what I'm saying, because it gets rid of all that that uh, that yeast in your system, that candida, all right, and it's deep, it's it's cleansing the blood, it's cleansing the whole body, you know what I'm saying, and as I said before, you know, this is something you can take with your day to day, you know, meal because. All the things, all the ingredients that I'm going to get to in a minute, you know, all the ingredients are just herbs and roots. So essentially it's food, you know, it's all food. So it's just, your, you know, you're eating it in a liquid form, okay? But um, let me read some of the statements here. It says, uh, you know, the problem, right? We have become a nation of constipation, stagnation, fermentation, putrefication, or, pre yeah, and also intoxication. We are poisoning our bloodstreams from the discharged feces that are rotting in our intestines, right? Because, yeah, a lot of us, you know, are not having, you know, proper bowel movements or not a, uh, not the right number of bowel movements, you know, per day. You know what I'm saying? So you eating and eating, but it's not going nowhere. It's being, you know, clawed up in your system. You know, you got to get that shit up out of you, literally, you know? You got to you got to make, you know, if it comes in, it has to go out. You know what I'm saying? But if it continues to stay in, you know, it, it's it's going to, you know, because the body is trying to live, it's going to come out one way or another, whether it be, you know, through your skin, you know. And that time's, hey, you know, shit. Um, you know, through mucus, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna try to find an escape route, you know, to 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 get out of the body because the body, you know, all, all these parasites, you know, these worms, all right, or you know, all these foreign GMO type ingredients, you know, they're um, that's just it. They're foreign to the body, you know. They don't want to exist in the body, so it's looking for a way out. But let me just read here. It says for half of Americans, the toxic waste. And the colon is sitting there for days instead of being limited several times a day without grunting or straining. And that's a, that's a fact. Our own fecal matter starts to slowly poison us, infecting and rotting tissue, degenerating our bowel, causing inflammation, hemorrhoids, polyps, fissures, ulcers, tumors, cancer. All right. Divert to colosis. Irritable bowel syndrome, Crohn's disease, varicose, and eventually chemists. We are self poisoning. Right. You know what I'm saying? And, hey, that's what a lot of our people, you know, and I, you know, I, I often say that, you know, especially like dealing with my family. Like, we die of dumb shit. We die of shit that's, you know, Lord, what preventable. You know what I'm saying? We're not dying of, you know, stab wounds and gunshot wounds. we dying of shit that's due to our diet, you know, due to our day-to-day -day eating regimen because we don't know how to eat, you know what I'm saying? Everything you've learned is learned from the white man, and he has you on this hamster wheel when you're in this go-go-go spirit where you don't take the time to 
grocery shop, or if you do, you're buying everything in a can or a box. You know what I'm saying? You're not buying fresh ingredients. You're not buying herbs, you know, like cilantro, parsley, all right? You know, you're not buying lettuce and tomatoes, cucumbers, olives, you know, things like this, you know, or fruits. You know what I'm saying? You're buying everything that's in a fucking box. And, and then not only, not only that, you put it in a microwave and, and call it and call it a meal. Like, all that shit is fake food. It's not even food. A lot of the shit that we eat today wasn't even available, you know, shit, 10 years ago, 20, 20 years ago, you know what I'm saying? All this shit is newly created, you know? So like, yeah, um, let's see. I don't want this video to be too long, so I'm gonna just jump down to the ingredients, you know, what you got to look forward to here, all right? All right, we got black seed, burdock root, slippery elm, bark, sheep, sorrel, watercress, turkey root, blessed thistle, red clover, kelp. All right, just to name a few. And I mean, you know, you see it here. It's, it's, yeah, you got maca in there. And brothers know what that maca do. You know, ginkgo biloba, you know, for your memory. All right, go to cola, distilled water. So, you know, hey, it's got great, it's a great blend of, of herbs and roots and, you know, ingredients. You know what I'm saying? Because even if, we're, even if, and hey, it's a great savings as well. Because if you were to buy all this stuff individually, and you know, you'll be you'll be paying a pretty penny. You know what I'm saying? But this, this bottle here, you know, what now the place is out of New York, but, um, you know, here in Detroit, they have a select, you know, herbal stores. You would have to go to some type of herbal store, you know, in your, you know, wherever you may be. And, you know, Lord willing, you should be able to find it. If not that, I know you can order it off of Amazon, all right? Or you can just go through this company directly. But I think it's a little more, or at least it's a little more than what, what we're paying here in Detroit uh, for this large bottle. Right, this large bottle right here of the of PSD, the Black Sea Detach, you can get it for like 35 bucks. But I think if you go through this site right here that I'm on, Herbal by Nature, I, I want to say it might be like 40 or 45. Right, you know, you just have to inquire and find out. But, um, but nonetheless, man, it's a great detach, man. You know, I recommend it for all the Akim, you know, to pick up. And it's gonna do wonders for you. Best believe that, you know. I just recently got over, um, I guess, something that was similar to the flu. And, uh, you know, I started taking this and it helped start breaking that shit. And now I noticed that uh, not just from the flu itself, but I was like spewing up and coughing up like, what I, I could say, I could tell like it was old ass mucus. It was deep, dark brown mucus like oh shit like damn and, and i'm coughing it from from the bottom of my esophagus you know what i'm saying it's, i can feel it literally coming up my out of my chest and um you know i just feel i can breathe better you know what i'm saying i don't have that weight on my chest you know what i'm saying um i'm able to digest few uh, <laughs> 10 times better you know where it's not um hard on my stomach you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you get that like that heartburn, or that that um, it's a, you know, it's it's a, I guess it's like heartburn sensation through your chest. You know what I'm saying? Where you you might have to like take a moment and like brace yourself, cause the, like the the pressure it be it be so so harsh on your system. You know you hate to even even bear it, but um. You know, this is going to help with all of that. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be able to have, you know, regular bowel movements, and it's going to be, you know, it's, <laughs> it's going to be a breeze. You know what I'm saying? Um, on top of that, you know, you want to drink, you know, lots of water to help flush your system out. You know what I'm saying? Alkaline, alkaline you know, water, 7.5 or better. You know, I, I would recommend 7.5 to... 
Um, you know, maybe 9.5. I know they got some 10s out there. You know, I don't try to go too alkaline. You can drink them, you know, once in a while. But um, damn sure not that tap water. Fuck that shit. Because, you know, they poison us, you know, as you know, through the water, you know, through the air, through the food we eat. So just to, to maintain, sustain, you know, this, this detox here will help, you know, a lot with that until we get the fuck out of here. So, you know, with that, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and the elders, a great millstone that rule well. And um, peace and salutation to you, Akim, this pushing this word in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the earth. Shalom.